All right, guys, what's going on? Your boy David Exclusive back at it once again with a new Bleach Brave Souls video, and it's kind of funny because we mentioned, or well, I mentioned these characters in my video yesterday, <laughs> or well, at least we did with Rukia. So apparently, the Oasis summons, the, the Desert Society summons, are coming back to Bleach Brave Souls. Um, yeah, so we got Ichigo, Yoruichi and Rukia guys, but uh, we all know Rukia is the most important one of the banner because Rukia is the one with the double link slot potion boost for uh, mind that is, so if you're gonna hunt for mind potions, Rukia is the one to get. So uh, this banner will return, step 5 and 10 obviously are a guaranteed 5 star, uh, the summons will happen starting from tomorrow, so we got Yoruichi. Uh, Rukia, Ichigo, Joshiro, the mind ver uh, the red version and the mind version. So we got two Joshiros in here. So Joshiro, the pulse version, which is power, a mind Neliel, power Aizen, so the red one. Joshiro, the mind one. We got blue Chad and mind Yukio. So quite common fillers. Then again, um, both the Joshiros aren't that bad in my opinion. They're actually pretty decent. Uh, Rukia is the main one to get, Yoruichi is fairly good, Ichigo is fun to play, Neliel is a common filler, such as Aizen, but they're both decent characters up until now, Chad is still a great PvP unit. So in general guys, this is definitely not a bad banner, so we've got Yoruichi, which is a normal attack Soul Reaper killer, our normal attack Link, Poise Enhancer, Flurry, great character to get. Uh, definitely with the flurry and the poise. Debilitator plus 5 seconds, so really not that bad. Rukia, as you guys can see, uh, Inheritance Zone only Mind Link Slot Potions plus 5. So I already got this character on one of my accounts. I'm actually still missing him on this account, as you guys can see. I got a total of 2000 orbs. Then again, guys, um, obviously this is a huge trap. Um, I don't know what they'll what they're gonna do for the end of the month or for the anniversary, which is coming up very soon. But uh, it's it's definitely a trap in my opinion. Uh, nevertheless, I'm still gonna try one or two multis on this because on this account I have 2,000 orbs, and I'm still missing that Rukia. Uh, I do have Ichigo, don't have Yoruichi, so uh, I do have all the fillers, so I'm just gonna try one or two multis and that's it. Uh, first two multis are 150 and 200 orbs, that's all I'll probably be spending. Maybe, I hope I won't be going in up until step 5, but knowing me, oh well. So yeah, uh, those are the fillers guys, so... Um, it's definitely a banner worth summoning on, in my opinion, but then again, I think it's gonna be a trap. So, uh, I wanna know though, what are y'all opinions on this? Please do let me know in the comments down below. I'm really curious what you guys are thinking. Are you guys gonna summon on this banner? Let me know in the comments. Are you guys gonna skip? How many orders will you guys be using? Let me know in the comments down below. Hit the like button down below, subscribe if you're new. And uh, yeah, that's it for this short video guys. So I hope you guys all enjoyed and I hope to see you guys all again in the next upcoming video. So on to the next one. Take care you guys. Later. Peace.